In the vast tapestry of classic Hollywood, Geraldine Fitzgerald remains a noteworthy thread, weaving her talent into the fabric of cinematic history. As we explore the corridors of her career, one cannot help but wonder about the lesser-known facets of this actress' life. Are there anecdotes that elude the spotlight but captivate your fascination? Perhaps you hold a cherished memory associated with Geraldine Fitzgerald that colors your appreciation for her work. Now, let's delve into the captivating realm of random facts about this iconic Hollywood figure. What details and stories lie beneath the surface, waiting to be unveiled? Share your thoughts and reminisce about the impact Geraldine Fitzgerald has had on your cinematic journey. We invite you to reveal your most cherished memory or personal experience related to this classic Hollywood actor in the comments below. Your stories add depth to the narrative of a talent that has left an indelible mark on the silver screen. So, join the conversation and share your insights, memories, and anecdotes about Geraldine Fitzgerald. We would love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. Now, let's unravel the layers of this cinematic journey together. Geraldine Fitzgerald, a notable actress, was surprisingly absent from the memorial tribute during the telecast of the 78th Annual Academy Awards in 2006. This omission is noteworthy considering her 1940 Academy Award nomination and her impactful roles in memorable films. Despite her contributions to the industry, she was overlooked in this annual tribute that honors artists who passed away since the previous year's show. Intriguingly, Fitzgerald's family connections extend beyond Hollywood. She is reportedly a distant relative of Irish author James Joyce. Her father's law firm, D&T Fitzgerald, even earned a mention in Joyce's classic novel, Ulysses. Notably, Fitzgerald's sister once worked for this law firm, creating a unique connection between the actress and the renowned literary figure. Apart from her accomplishments in the entertainment world, Fitzgerald received the Handel Medallion, New York City's highest cultural award. This recognition was bestowed upon her for civic work, particularly her efforts in providing theater opportunities for ghetto students through her street theater company. This demonstrates her commitment to using the arts as a means to empower and uplift communities. Geraldine Fitzgerald's multifaceted connections, both familial and cultural, coupled with her dedication to civic engagement, paint a picture of an actress whose impact transcends the silver screen. The memorial tribute oversight serves as a curious note in her legacy, highlighting the complexities and nuances of recognition in the world of entertainment. Geraldine Fitzgerald, the accomplished actress, faced a challenging chapter in the early 90 seconds when signs of Alzheimer's disease began to surface. The death of her husband in 1994 exacerbated the severity of her illness, marking a difficult period in her life. Despite these personal struggles, Fitzgerald maintained connections that shaped her journey. Notably, she shared a lifelong friendship with Irish actress Maureen O'Sullivan, a bond that originated during their school days as Vivian Lee's classmates. In the later stages of her life, Fitzgerald found her final resting place at Woodlawn Cemetery in Bronx, New York, specifically in Chestnut Hill, Section 111, Lot 12461, within the Scheftel family plot. This unassuming location serves as a poignant reminder of the actress' lasting impact on the entertainment industry. Geraldine Fitzgerald's life, marked by personal challenges and enduring friendships, provides a nuanced perspective on the complexities of fame and relationships. Her journey from the early days with Vivian Lee to the enduring friendship with Maureen O'Sullivan reflects the diverse facets of her experiences. Geraldine Fitzgerald, a versatile actress with a rich history, had connections that span both aristocracy and the entertainment industry. In her first marriage to Edward Lindsay Hogg, an aspiring songwriter, the couple relocated to New York from England in 1938 to support his ambitions. Later, she married Stuart Scheftel, the grandson of Isidore Strauss, co-owner of R.H. Macy Co., who tragically perished on the Titanic. Scheftel, destined for the ill-fated voyage, was left behind due to a cold, eventually becoming a successful businessman and co-founder of New York's Pan and Building. Notably, during her initial marriage, Geraldine Fitzgerald held the title of Lady Lindsay Hogg, and her son Michael inherited the distinguished title of Lord. Moreover, her Broadway debut in 1938 in the Mercury Theatre production of Heartbreak House alongside Orson Welles marked the beginning of her remarkable stage career. 
These diverse facets of Fitzgerald's life, from her aristocratic connections to her impactful roles on Broadway, paint a compelling portrait of an actress whose journey unfolded against the backdrop of both high society and the theatrical world. This intriguing blend of personal and professional experiences sheds light on the complexity of her life, adding depth to the legacy of Geraldine Fitzgerald. Geraldine Fitzgerald's extensive career is marked by a remarkable presence in five Oscar Best Picture nominees, including notable films like Wuthering Heights, Dark Victory, Watch on the Rhine, Wilson, and Rachel, Rachel. Beyond her cinematic achievements, Fitzgerald received critical acclaim for her role as Mary Tyrone in Long Day's Journey and Tonight on Broadway in 1971, where she shared the stage with Robert Ryan. Notably, her versatility is evident in the range of genres and mediums she successfully navigated, leaving an indelible mark on both the silver screen and the theater stage. These accomplishments underscore her enduring impact on the entertainment industry, reflecting a career that seamlessly transitioned between Hollywood and Broadway. Geraldine Fitzgerald's contributions to cinema and theater continue to resonate, solidifying her legacy as a distinguished actress with a multifaceted artistic imprint. Daughter of William, a solicitor, and Mary Fitzgerald, actress Geraldine Fitzgerald's early life was shaped by her time in a London convent school. Notably, her family's law firm had esteemed clients like William Butler Yeats and James Joyce, who frequented the Fitzgerald home during her childhood. This unique blend of a legal background and literary connections laid the foundation for Fitzgerald's multifaceted journey. Growing up in this environment, Fitzgerald's life took diverse turns. Not only did she forge lasting friendships with notable figures like Anne Shirley, evidenced by Shirley's attendance at a taping of Fitzgerald's guest appearance on The Golden Girls, but she also carved her own path in the entertainment industry. Fitzgerald's cinematic legacy includes two films, Wuthering Heights and The Pawnbroker, both recognized by the Library of Congress and the National Film Registry for their cultural and historical significance. This nod to her contributions speaks to the enduring impact she had on the silver screen. From her early days in a London convent to the golden era of Hollywood, Fitzgerald's life unfolded against a backdrop of literary giants, legal minds, and cinematic achievements. This article aims to delve into the layers of her journey, exploring the intersections of her personal connections, early influences, and cinematic contributions. Join us as we navigate the remarkable tapestry of actress Geraldine Fitzgerald's life and career. As the curtains fall on our exploration of actress Geraldine Fitzgerald's illustrious career, we invite you, dear reader, to bask in the afterglow of her cinematic legacy. Fitzgerald, a luminary whose performances resonate through the corridors of time, leaves behind a tapestry of characters that have touched our hearts and minds. Take a moment to traverse the realms of memory and reflect on your personal connection with this unparalleled talent. What scenes linger in the recesses of your consciousness? Which of Fitzgerald's portrayals stirred your emotions or sparked introspection? We beckon you to share these cherished recollections, allowing the collective appreciation for her craft to thrive and endure. Your narratives are the threads that weave the rich fabric of appreciation for Geraldine Fitzgerald's contribution to the world of entertainment. Whether it's her poignant dramatic roles or moments of comedic brilliance, each memory contributes to the mosaic of admiration we collectively hold for this cinematic virtuoso. As we bid adieu to this exploration, we extend our deepest gratitude for your time and interest in revisiting the luminous career of actress Geraldine Fitzgerald. Your reflections add depth to the narrative, and together we celebrate the enduring impact she has left on the tapestry of entertainment. Thank you for sharing in the journey of remembrance and appreciation. Until our next cinematic odyssey, be well, and may the echoes of Fitzgerald's performances continue to resonate in your cinematic soul.